I've decided to squat to make this camera angle work. It's just too silly. I'm going to have to adjust the camera, so bear with me. That's better. It's really kind of cold today, but I've come out here anyway. I really, really, really want to get some track bed down. There's two kinds of track bed that need to go down in this garden. Where the track bed's going to be raised, I mean over here, I'm going to have to put that on some kind of raised board. Back in the rockery, I can't do that so easily, particularly as I want to put a tunnel there. What I've been planning to do is to put a level bed of bricks. This is just four pieces of Hornby double O gauge track that I've soldered together. It's first radius, which is the smallest curve that Hornby say you should use. Just to use as a template for the curve, that's what I've decided on is my minimum radius. Everything should work if I stick to that. I'm gonna to talk to you while I work. I've just set this brick down here. It's more or less level. It's high enough that my track bed coming into the rockery area will clear the, um, the rock just here. I'd quite like it to go round that. If it was a bit lower, it'd be quite fun, but I'm just not convinced the fence is going to give us enough clearance, so I'm playing it well on the safe side because I can't take chunks out of the fence. So this, now, that's going to dictate the height of the railway around the rest of the garden. So everywhere this railway goes, it's going to be at this level. Not too bad. Oops. Hey. This all felt like quite good fun until I got to this point, and then the fun increased. <laughs> Just seeing these rocks in place and imagining what they're going to look like when the trains are running in front of them is quite exciting. I had more or less entirely forgotten as well that once the track gets to this area just here, it needs to come back alongside the track that came in, but I hadn't left room. I've looked at this rock that's left on the end, that's going to be a real life cutting. Uh, it's relatively soft and I can get through it with a bolster. Phew. Well, I've got to pack up and get going, but if you want to keep track of things, join me next time for another episode of Whoopee! I'm putting a train in my garden.